Once again, we are going to start the second part of the awards. Please take your seats. You can bring your drinks, you can bring your weed, you can bring whatever you need to bring. Just bring it with you. Yeah, yeah, you know. You won't want to start till you're ready. Charlie won't start till you're ready. She's too professional for that. Way too professional. We'll give you a minute to get sorted. We're nice like that. Take your seats as soon as you can, and we can give away some more fantastic awards for free. Yeah. At least you know if you're not going to be an MC anymore, Dynamite. You could be one of those people at the underground that tells you not to stand near the yellow line. It's my dream job. My dream job. job. My dream job. It's true. All right, I think we're good. I, I think, think we're good. I think we've got everyone here now. What right. do you reckon? Take it away. Okay, so one more time, will everyone please show your appreciation for Katie's ambition? <laughs> She was good. I, she I liked was it. Pretty good. She was really good. <laughs> All right, here we go. It's round two. <laughs> I knew I'd get that in at some point. <laughs> We're not messing around now, people. The following awards are reserved for the very best in the game. I'm talking the best label, the best MC, the best DJ, the best album, the best track, the best producer, the best haircut, the best jacket, the best postcode, and also the Hall of Fame award. People, we are about to get very serious and celebrate the very best of drum and bass. And it all starts right this minute with best label. Oh yes, it does. Okay, so labels are one of the most important forces in drum and bass, if not the most important force. It is their job to filter out the noise and curate <laughs> and nurture the very best talent the scene has to offer and bring out the best in them. Wouldn't you say, Dynamite? The best. I'd say as well. The best. So the best labels do this with such skill that their fans will buy every single release without even questioning it. <laughs> Apparently. Uh, and these are the top five shortlisted nominated labels that the drum and bass arena fans have respected and cherished the most. Top five nominations for best label are... <laughs> Critical Music. <laughs> Hospital Records. Ram Records Shogun Audio Virus Recordings Labels don't come any bigger than that. Props to every label who reach the nominated stage. But as always, there can only be one winner, and my good friend Charlie is gonna announce them right now. It's on you, Charlie, all eyes on you. Okay, so the winner of Best Label, voted by Drum Bass Arena fans 2013, goes to... Ron Australia, Stereo Sonic Tour, but yeah, well, what a great honour. I think we'll have another good year. Uh, thanks to all, this, all the office crew, all the artists on the label, um, everyone behind the scenes, all the guys that are distributors, everything like that. Yeah, thank you very much. Much appreciated.
A big win for Andy C's Ram Records. Shout out to Red One. Nice, nice, nice. The awards just keep on coming. They keep on coming. They just keep on coming. They just keep on coming. <laughs> 21 years deep and still commanding full control of the dance with a roster of artists that stretches from the brightest young talents to the biggest acts in electronic music. Much love to the well-deserved winners, Ram Records. All right, Charlie, please, the suspense is killing me. What's up next? Okay, so it's a big one, Dynamite. Now, we're about to find out what the public have decided is the best track of the year. This is a massive one. No, 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 no. This is a huge award right now. This is the best track of 2013. Just think how many amazing tunes have been released this year, and it's been boiled down to just one. one. Just one. Just one. I don't think I could pick a winner. I don't think I could. But before we find out which one, let's see the five favorites that have been shortlisted from the top 10 nominations. Video Man, run the BT. <laughs> top five nominations for best track are. <laughs> Wilkinson, Afterglow. <laughs> Rockwell, Detroit. <laughs> Matthews and Isaco, Contemporary. Cole, Searching. Inside Info and Matthews, Lethos. And the winner of Best Track 2013, Balcony, who do you think it is? No, it's not. <laughs> <laughs> Give it up for Wilkinson Afterglow! Shout out to obviously Scott and Andy, Alex and Gilbert and Mark and John, who are my managers. And to be fair, like Vision Obi, right? Every time we're in a rave, he always gets all the girls to sing it and, it, and it's a good laugh. But yeah, thanks for everyone that's voted. Um, yeah, I'm just gonna leave now. But yeah, thank you, Ram. Thank you, Virgin. Thanks, guys. Right. What a stunning tune, beautiful vocals. A big shout to Becky Hill as well, the singer on that track, lovely. Afterglow was big on the radio, it was big on the dance floor, it was big in the festivals, it was big everywhere. It was a big look for DMB scenarios internationally. And it's the second award that Wilkerson has won tonight, so double props to him for getting double bubble. We like that. So, massive achievement, Drum and Bass Awards, Drum and Bass Arena, two. 2013. Time is ticking, Charlie. Tell us, what is next? Well, I think it's about time that we talk about the best album, mm. don't you? Best album? Yeah, they're, yeah? They're, 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 barely, they're barely with it. Best they're not, album. They're not quite there. <laughs> One of my favorite awards when, come on, Friction, wake up, bro. I can see you. Come on, man. <laughs> One of my favorite awards, when executed with thought and diligence, albums are an art form in themselves. Narratives that showcase an artist at their boldest, most creative. There is nothing like adding a generally good album to your collection. Now, last year was an absolute major, major year for albums. 
Did the drum and bass community step up to such a high benchmark? Charlie, what do you think? I think that's very deep of you to say, darling. Like, Sorry. first of all. <laughs> of course, drum and bass community stepped up. And these are the five that have been shortlisted that the public love the most. Should we have a look at them? Let's look. Let's have a look. The top five nominations for best album are. <laughs> Caliber, Spill. Alex Perez, Chroma Chords. Subfocus, Taurus. Hamon Cricket, Zeitgeist. Wilkinson, lasers not included. Well, there it is. There it is. There it is. The nominations of best album. I'm loving every single one of those albums. Yes, I am. So, Charlie, please do the honors and put the eager producers out of their misery. Okay, so the winner of best album as voted by the drum and bass arena viewers 2013 goes to. Camo and Cricket Zygon! <laughs> hey, this is Camo and Crooked. Sorry we can't be here with you guys to celebrate this amazing event, but best album, winning it, means so much for us, Zeitgeist. Yeah, thanks to everybody for voting for us for the best album. I think this year has been really strong for drum and bass, so it means even more to us. Uh, also, big thanks to Hospital Records and uh, the whole team who's been supporting us on tour. Uh, we hope you have a fun celebration and hopefully see you guys next year. Bye bye. Thank you. Bye bye. Uh, that looked like it was recorded in Guantanamo Bay. I don't know where they are right now, but I'm sure they're safe. Don't worry. Don't worry. Weird. Yeah, that, was weird. that was a little bit weird, wasn't it? Modern technology. So sizzling shouts to Camo and Crooked, a very, very well-deserved win. I don't think any of us saw this album coming, to be honest. Funkier than anything that they have ever done before, with all sorts of creative departures throughout. The Austrian duo absolutely nailed it. So well done, boys. Wherever they may be. Now Dynamite, do you know what time it is? I know exactly what time it is. <laughs> I do. Why don't you? Tell them what time it is. Okay, so this isn't the time to be playing around. This is possibly one of my favorite awards of the night. You cool. know it's one of my favorites, cool. okay. We are about to officially anoint a new member of the Drum Bass Arena Hall of Fame. A unique prize in our awards ceremony, the Hall of Fame Award goes to outstanding contributions to the scene. And it's the only award that has not been chosen by the voters. This one was decided by a stronghold panel of 100 industry insiders. Oh yes. oh, yes. Oh, yes. And the winner will be in very good company. Previous distinguished peers of the German Bass Arena Hall of Fame include none other than the great groove rider Goldie Friction, Andy C, DJ Hype, 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 and two <laughs> posthumous <laughs> honors to Chemistry and Stevie Hyper D. Yeah, that deserves a round of applause. Yeah. Thank you for taking the initiative. That's me, you're so smooth. The Hall of Fame is strictly for the scene's vvv of VIPs, creators who push the genre to such new levels. We wouldn't be here if it wasn't for them. True. So Charlie, it is true. Yeah, it's everything true. I say is true. So Charlie, <laughs> who did our panel of industry insiders vote in the Hall of Fame this year? Okay, so to many, this man is regarded as the most forward-thinking, agenda-setting producer drum bass has ever spawned. He's been active in the game for over 20 years, Woo! and to this day remains one of the most referenced men in the dark art of production. Dark. His bass lines are still recognized as beyond next level, and his muscular, mind-bending production dynamics inspired an entire generation of producers. A killer selector and a real-life sonic scientist, he's actually been engineering bespoke sound systems since he was only 14, including, and you might have heard of it, the one and only Valve Sound System. People, we are talking about Mr. Cybertron himself. Please, will you give it up for 
for Mr. Dillinger. Hello, this is Dillinger. I'm so chuffed to win this award, Hall of Fame. You know, people like Friction, DJ Hype, Chemistry have won it before me, Stevie Hyper D. It's so nice to be acknowledged for 20 years of hard work by people that actually know. I'd like to say thanks to my mum for letting me play loud music throughout the house, loads of bass, rattling the windows and everything. Years and years as a teenager. Without that, I think you wouldn't be able to tune the bass lines right and do what I've done. So thank you, mum. Thanks to everyone. Thank you. Thanks. It ain't too loud. Big, big, big up to the man like Dylan Sharp Valve. Shout to Lemon D as well, the whole team. That's nice. All right, Charlie. Okay, it's official. There are only three more awards to go, and they really don't get much bigger than these winners. Ladies and gentlemen, we are about to find out who the top five shortlisted Mike Munching, you like that term, don't you? No. Nominees are <laughs> for the best MC. Woo, best MC, yeah. The nominees for the best MC are... GQ. We represent one ten percent and no less. SPMC. Why do we die with no rest? Yeah. Check the flex, come on. No pressure, no pressure rising. Deep start. DRS. Attempting to counter ten. Can't keep tiling. Boat race starts the screen. Double, double, double. That's our bad war. This way out. X Man. Cut me a micro. My very hard work. You better do it. Dynamite. What a talented and very handsome looking bunch of MCs. Wow. And he's wow. not just talking about himself either, honestly. Yeah. <laughs> you know what? We're all family here, okay? We could, I think we should just skip the formalities. Let's just leave the envelope alone. We know, you know, I know that I got it. So I want to say thank you very much, okay, to the German Bass Fraternity. All right, now, I promised myself I wasn't gonna cry. I'm not gonna cry. I knew if I kept saying, here, and one, two, three, four, I would get there in the end. That's what it takes. All right, thank you. Uh, uh, Dynamite, hold on a second. Hold Dynamite, seriously. Does anyone else feel really awkward? Dude. And the winner for the best MC goes to D-R-S. No pressure, no pressure rising. Teeth start grinding, attempting to counter them. Can't keep tires. Both race starts to scream. Now no hiding. Really? Sweat I'm running really down my brow. Almost yeah. blinding. Yeah. Yeah. Really that's that's, that's no all right, count. that's all right. Well, D-R-S can't be here tonight. So I am going to, uh, you know, <laughs> I'll pass it on. I'll pass it on. I'll take it on behalf of DRS, a really good guy, master of ceremonies of the highest distinction. It's all fun and games next year. DRS takes the best MC crown for the second year in a row. Not bad. Not bad. Yeah. Shout out to Strategy and the Manchester crew, Dub Physics, Large Up. One of the most talented, lyrical, wits, and nicest MCs in the game. Massive congratulations to DRS. DRS. Okay. Charlie, two more trophies to go. Why don't you tell the beautiful people here tonight what's next? So, our penultimate prize goes to the best producer. One of the hardest categories to pick just one resounding winner. There have been so many next level releases this year, I think you'll all agree. And any of the 10 nominated producers in this room could walk away with this tonight, I think anyway. You know what, you're absolutely right. And one of them better, so we're gonna take it as well. This award is strictly for the artists who've been on their A game with every single release throughout 2013. And these are the top shortlisted five who the German bass loving public adored the most. VT! The top five nominations for best producer are. 
Noisier. Wilkinson. Matthews. Come on, Crooked. Audio. Okay, so what an amazing lineup this year, Dynamite. Not that I'm biased or anything. No, of course not. Why don't you open that envelope and put everyone out of their misery and tell us who has won the best producer 2013? The winner of Best Producer 2013, yeah, you just said it, I'm sorry, <laughs> is Camel and Crooked! <laughs> from hospitality to come on the stage and take your award. That's the good one. So this is Matt Riley. Matt Riley a and would this whole album. Yeah, but this is, be this is be the best producer. I didn't teach him how to produce. <laughs> so on their behalf, they are in Vienna. Um, they can't be here tonight. We are absolutely delighted on their behalf to receive this award. I'd like to personally give a massive shout to Audio because I think it's fucking amazing. But on behalf of all of Vienna and Austria and all of my Forest Hill SE26 fucking massive team, thank you very much. Okay, so Camo and Crooked, two awards in one night, not bad, eh? Not bad. Not bad. No, no, uh, not bad. Best album and now best producer. What victorious evening it's been for the Austrian duo and very well deserved too. Owners of the funkiest slap bass sounds in DB and they have upped their game incredibly this year. And let's face it, their game was up to ready. A massive congratulations to Camo and Crooked. So, Diana, this yes. is it. This is the moment that we have been building up to all night. I'm sure everyone knows what it is. Ladies and gentlemen, it's the very last accolade of Drum and Bass Arena Awards 2013. We have saved the very best to last. Everybody, we are about to find out who the fans have nominated for Best DJ. You know it's coming. Well, creative, you don't have to make any noise, don't worry. <laughs> While creative skills can be found in every single corner of Drum and Bass, it all began with the fine art of the selector. And as long as DJ's wheels keep turning, the scene will keep on evolving. True? True. These artists are out there traveling the world, demonstrating the raw power of drum and bass each and every night, breaking tunes with every technically mind-blowing set. The best DJs are right on the front line as card-carrying ambassadors of the drum and bass scene. True, true, true. So, let's find out the top five, whoops, <laughs> shortlisted <laughs> nominations for this year's highly coveted prize. Watch the screen. The top five nominations for Best DJ are... Camo and Crooked. Andy C. Friction. AMC Woo. Best DJ So Dynamite it is the last award of the night So you probably should tell everyone Because they probably want to know Open the envelope it is my pleasure to open this envelope and reveal German Bass Arena Best DJ of 2013. First of all, big up to everyone on that list right there, man. The winner is 
I call him the people's champion because he truly <laughs> is Mr. Andy C. What's happening, everyone? I'm just out in Australia on tour and found out I've won the best DJ award. Thank you to everybody that voted. The, the continued support is, you know, it's truly mind blowing. Thank you to everybody. Um, big shout to Drum Bass Arena for putting on the awards. Thank you to everybody in the room, all the drum and bass community, because our scene is just so so big. And uh, you know, from the label owners, the producers, the guys that put on the events, you know, we've we've got something absolutely amazing here. So big shout to you guys. Uh, thanks to Scott, special thanks to Scott for uh, you know, helping us have an incredible year and uh, a big, big love to the Ram crew. I wish I was there with you guys tonight because I know you're on the tables enjoying the drinks, but big love to you guys from everybody in the office, all the artists that are making the incredible music that we to get, get to put out, everybody that does our events. You know, it's a really special thing and we're going into our 22nd year next year, which is... Uh, Never would have imagined that would have happened. So big love to you guys. I cannot wait to see you at Fabric and enjoy a few drinks. And uh, yeah, thanks once again. Have a good night, everyone. See you later. Okay, so there he goes. The best DJ in the Drum Bass Arena Awards 2013. Let's face it. Pretty much every other award ceremony we've probably ever held. Every one. Mr. Andy C. Well, I heard a rumor that Andy C actually owns John Bass Arena and he gives himself this award every year. So I don't know if that's true. Maybe it is, maybe it ain't. You know, it's not for me to I, speculate. I'm I just, know, I'm just a host. I heard a rumor it's not actually Andy that DJs, but it's actually Scott Red One's hands from behind the deck. That's that makes, what I heard. That makes sense. That, ex that explains. Oi, oi, oi. Thank you. There's many rumors. Keep them both on. Keep them both on. But. Okay. Let's keep it going. So. Thank you very much, everybody, for coming out tonight and celebrating the John Bass Arena's 2013 awards. Charlie, where do we go from here? Where do we possibly go from here? Okay, so obviously we have a lot of thank yous tonight. We obviously have to thank everybody for coming down tonight, including everyone upstairs. Those of you on the tables don't know, but if you turn around and look upstairs, everybody that's voted is also here with us. We have celebrated the very best in the game. And 14 decorated acts have very special awards sitting amongst us tonight, as voted by the drum and bass public. Now, it's been an absolute pleasure hosting, well, I wouldn't say absolute pleasure hosting, but it's been delightful, uh, hosting with Dynamite right. this evening. And we have to just say a few thank yous, of course, to our sponsors as well. Thank you very much to Exit Travel and AI, 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 which took me a while to say earlier. Thank you very much. <laughs> for being involved in this year's awards and thank you to every single drum and bass loving fan around the world watching on DMB TV tonight who have voted and made these awards possible. Wonderful work, Charlie. Very nice to work with you this evening. Thank you so much. And of course, and of course, a monster thanks to everyone who's in the room right now, from the nominated men and women to the trophy touting winners, and just as importantly, all the people who've been pushing buttons and setting agendas behind them, all right? The German bass scene is bigger than ever before, and a lot of hard work has gone on behind the scenes to make the success stories happen. Mighty props are in order for everyone involved in this game we hold so close to our hearts, yes. So, people, before we dive head first to the bar, and I mean head first, yeah. please, for one last time, raise your glasses, stomp your feet, make some noise for everybody in the room, all the people voting, and for the most, yeah. make some noise for German Bass! Thank you, have a great night, enjoy yourselves, hit the bar, DJ, play some music, thank you, Charlie.